Hi, PokeTrader18 here. I have a very cool item to show you guys today. Um, I just got this in, in the mail. This is a Shadowless Base Set Starter Deck, the two player starter deck. Um, technically, this is the first Pokemon trading card game related item ever released. It's a very cool item. Um, it's unsealed, but everything inside of it is still sealed, which is fine with me because I wanted to look inside of it and show you guys what's in it anyway. Um, I'll let you look at the front of the box here. On the sides. Um, I'll read the back for you here. Um, start a new Pokemon adventure with the Pokemon trading card game. Just like in the best-selling Pokemon Game Boy game, only those who train hard will become great Pokemon masters. In the Pokemon trading card game, you collect and train your favorite Pokemon to challenge rival Pokemon trainers using the special attacks you've seen in the popular animated TV show. Do you have the skills to be the very best? Challenge a friend to the Pokemon trading card game and find out. Wow. They say Pokemon a lot. It's like they're drilling it into your brain. <laughs> First edition holographic Machamp card in each box, available only in the starter set. And then it shows what's included within the box. We have some energy cards. Um, yeah, so let's open this up. Here we have... Two... 30 card um, decks, which is kind of strange because I thought you had to have 60 cards to play each other, but it's a two player starter deck, so I guess you start playing with 30, it's just like a practice thing, I don't know. I don't know what kind of cards are in here, I'll have to look it up, but they're all shadowless, but definitely not worth unsealing these because I'm sure it's just all uncommons and commons. Um, then, of course, we have the sealed Shadowless First Edition Machamp. Very nice. Um, we have the damage counters, which are marbles. I believe they moved up to a cardboard um, soon after this was released. Then we have the rule book. And a quick start guide. Um, let's check out the rule book real quick. Here we have an advertisement for the um, Pokemon VHS and uh, a comic book series. Some cool illustrations. There's a War Turtle holding a Voltorb. The first edition base set Charizard. Some more illustrations. Here's explaining the uh, special conditions. And here's some kind of mail in offer. Here's a checklist for the base set, um, base set, <laughs> all the cards there, Oops. Then here we have the, uh, other, uh, starter decks that were released. The, uh, Zap theme deck was my first Pokemon trading card game related item I ever bought. I actually traded the Mewtwo for the first edition of Champ from the starter set, um, which I think was kind of a bad trade. <laughs> um, yeah. Yep, and then here's the quick start guide. Basically just shows the anatomy of the cards. Yeah, so it's pretty cool. Now, one common misconception about the uh, base set Machamp is that a lot of people think that the Shadowless one came from the uh, first edition uh, base set booster packs, whereas the Unlimited one came from the uh, starter deck. This is completely untrue. Um, all base set Machamps came from the starter decks, the two player starter decks. Um, as far as I'm concerned, this is the real first edition uh, Machamp. Of course, it's Shadowless like all the other first edition. 
um, cards in the base set and it's got the darker illustration now what happened was when Wizards of the Coast moved on to the new unlimited look for the Pokemon cards um, of course the starter deck became the new unlimited but instead of removing the first edition stamp from the Machamp like they should have done um, they left it there and I'm guessing that's just to keep selling the first the um, the starter deck um, but as far as I'm concerned this is just an unlimited card with the first edition stamp on it it's not really the first edition Machamp um, also these are the only two versions of the um, Machamp from the base set there is no shadowless without the first edition stamp these are the only two right here and they only came from the starter decks. So I hope that cleared up a little bit of confusion that you might have had about this card. Um, that's going to do it for this video. I want to thank you guys for watching. And I'll have more videos coming very soon with some very, very awesome cards to show. Um, thank you very much for watching. Comment, rate, and subscribe. And I'll see you guys very soon. Bye.